Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Lisa and today we're talking about something very exciting, something that has been on my mind for a bit and it's a really big change that I made in my life. And this big change has been actually saying yes less and no more. So as a people pleaser, I am one that always wanted to say yes. I am terrified of people not liking me. I am terrified of letting somebody down. And in today's world, we are constantly hearing messages about how we need to be saying yes more, how we need to be pushing ourselves. And while there is a level that I agree with that, I think that we need to be pushing ourselves to move forward. I think that we need to be saying yes to things that scare us. Something really big happens when we say yes. By saying yes, we inadvertently say no to a lot of other things. So what do I mean by that? I've noticed this comes up in my personal life and in my business. So when I say yes to something, and it's not a complete hell yes to me, it's not something that brings me joy, I pay for it later on. So if I'm saying yes to a brand that doesn't wanna pay me, if I'm being negotiated down by a client, I don't feel valued. And when I go to invest that time with that client or that brand, when I don't feel valued, that time is now being stolen away from the things that bring me joy. It's time that's stolen away from my creativity, time that's stolen away from my passion and my purpose. So even though I said yes in the beginning because I thought that that would bring about more opportunity, it's actually squashing my own goals. So now I've learned that I can say no to something up front, even though it feels a little bit uncomfortable, a lot uncomfortable actually, and as a result, I have this time left where I can put it towards something that gives me joy. So this is something that I've really been thinking about a lot lately in a world where we're being pushed to say yes to more, to push ourselves further and further, to really sit back and think, what would saying no to this opportunity mean for you? Are you actually missing out or are you gaining valuable time back in your life to make your brand grow? Well, maybe not even your brand. Are you gaining time back in your life to make your life more joyful? Because I personally know that by not saying yes to all these things, I have more time to grow my business, more time to grow my personal development. I have more time to do the things that give me joy rather than the things that kind of steal joy from me. So it's really, really profound, but I think the more that we can say no to, the, as long as it's not out of fear, the more we end up saying yes to, but the things that we're saying yes to are the things that we actually want to say yes to. Super curious how you guys feel about this topic. So if you've got thoughts, leave it in the comments below. I'd love to have a conversation about the power of no and see if you agree, if you don't agree. Subscribe, give it a like, and I'll see you guys in the next video.